A Fusion Pro! How easy is that? Ah, oh, this is cool. There's actually a, an alignment guide system that you can use. It always lines up perfectly. Hi guys, it's uh, Tim from Cradlers and today we're back again. This time what we're doing is kind of testing out a new layout and we've got a new camera and we've got a new background. But today, what we're gonna talk about? A Fusion Pro, that's what we ought to see. All right, you like that? Keep coming then. For this uh, Fusion Pro, what we're gonna do is just talk about a few things that I actually like about this machine. One of them is that camera view is so much more easier than using my old Rayjet, which my Rayjet I used to have to try and get some rulers, line up whereabouts I put an item in there. So if I just grab some sort of a item like this lens cap thing here, and I just want to sit that in there and engrave it, what I end up having to do is measure from the top to the bottom, roughly where about the laser pointer is and figure it all out where it's going to be. Or I can try to move the machine over the top of where it is and get those x y coordinates and figure it out it just takes a little bit of time doing it so what i end up doing now is i can grab the same item throw that in my old fusion pro and end up just sitting it there and as long as i got it somewhere near where the camera is over the top of where the camera is sitting inside lasers just chuck the design shirt on top of it and off i go you want to have a look come on then let's go we'll have a look hey guys make sure that you uh, remember to hit that bell icon you gotta tap it down there oi it's where is it there you go, tap it down there. That's right, hit that bell icon. Make sure you do it. You won't be notified of any other videos that we have coming out. If you haven't already, make sure you do subscribe. You need to do that too. That's pretty cool. Make sure you do. We're making some cool videos here. Come on. Right, let's get back into it. All right, guys, so we just jump in over here onto our uh, Corel drawer. We'll open up a file. Just make sure we've got the sizes here for our Fusion Pro, which is the 609.6 .6 by 609.6. .6. Uh, we set this to perceptual, it's in RGB. Open her up, and what we do is we just grab the text tool here, we're just making the words, hello. This would be cool, you set them to whatever size you want. Oops, what we do is we make sure that our laser over there is all fired up. Um, hit this print button. Make sure that we've got epilogue engraver selected, and we've got it on selection, so it's grabbing our selection. So we've selected that, and we hit print. It fires up the epilogue dashboard and then we've got a piece of wood we've just shoved into the laser. We put it in underneath this middle bar here which is around where this camera is because that way the camera is the most accurate. You can line that up to the board and hit etch. How easy is that? If we want to, we could even use these circle things as a guide. We can go, look, we want to make a 40 mil ring and we can set that, cut up a little 40 mil circle, drop it into that slot there. You can set this tag here to just say 35 mil. And we made that 35 mil. Move that over there. Align that to the center of this. Boom. And there you go. We're ready to etch inside that 40 mil ring. If we put a little disc inside of that, it'll etch the word hello straight on top of it. Put the design on there as a little guide. Ah. Oh. This is cool. So guys, that's what we do. We come over here, we fire up that laser. Once we've got the laser all on and um, initiated, uh, the lights come on, uh, it's able to send the data across to the computer. We jump over there on the computer. That's where we line up the design onto our bed. So just we just use the word hello, but we can make whatever design we wanted. Put the piece of wood inside the laser, then grab, press print, and then in the dashboard, we just bring the word hello over to where the piece of wood is, line that wherever you like it, and we're all good to go. We just press print, it starts lasering it, and it ends up turning it into, just, just so we end up getting a little tag. So you can get like one of these little tags like this in here, and sit that down inside the that hole where we put it, and repeat the word hello straight across the top of front, on, on the front of this little tag. How cool is that? That's pretty cool. So, I really like that feature. It's not the most accurate feature on it, but there is a, another way of getting more accurate. Because we have the Fusion Pro, there's actually a, an alignment guide system that you can use, and that'll help really align things. So on that piece of board, if we actually put a few dots on there, we can actually make it register those dots and align it right to the center point. But just for a quick little thing, that's as long as you can put it in underneath where the camera is, it's gonna be fairly accurate. It's just a couple of millimeters out or so in the spot there. So it just depends on exactly how accurate you want it to be. But normally, just for most things, especially if you just had a bit of an old off-cut, like if you had 
If I just go over here, yeah, there we go. So we've got a board like this one here. So we get this one here. Just say you wanted about to cut another circle out just down there. Well, just lay that board in there and then just line it up to it and cut it out. Doesn't matter if it's, it's not 100% accurate, but it's um, close enough that you'll get that little cut out of it. How cool is that? It's a pretty cool. One of the other things that I like to do with this laser is make up little boards like this one here. You can focus that one in there. And what it does is we've got a little spot here. We've just got the name of what type of board that we've got put it on here. Oh, where is it? On this side here. There we go. So a little name for on the board just there. We like to make sure that we, we just call it something and we put a couple of little dots in the corners and that way we can use those registration marks to just throw this bit of board in there. It'll register where it is, throw all the little cutout rings that we got or the, the discs that we're using and then just drop our design straight on top of it. It's It always lines up perfectly. So that's another cool thing for what this Fusion Pro can do. So if you want, just make sure that you uh, write in the comments down below that any other thing that you want to know about it on our Fusion Pro, that there's some of the things that we like to do with it is use up the alignment grids and also just throw different jobs in there with all sorts of different um, cut out like spots like this here. We want to use up little gaps. We can just throw the design on top of there and we use that pretty cool that camera registration thing it's a cool little feature yeah that's about it for today so if you like that video make sure you do like it hit that bell icon down there if you haven't already please subscribe keep it making see ya